zero here. According to what I have on my screen. SC Villa have made changes to their secretariat staff as the new Uganda Premier League season dawns on Ugandan football. With two days to their league opener this Friday, the record champions have appointed former police FC patron Asan Kasinje as spokesperson and former club captain William Kemba filling the post of chief executive officer. It has become imperative, it has been seen as um, necessary uh, for us to uh, improve in our administration, governance, and I think that's why it has been done. We had some unfilled uh, positions that uh, we needed to fill in people, and we have been uh, uh, trying to look for the possible uh, uh, notable people to take up the positions. Villa will open their quest for a title challenge against newly promoted Kitara FC at Wankurukuku. Villa fell on the last day to a 1-0 defeat at the hands of URA last season and extended their wait for a first league title since 2004 to probably this season. However, senior vice president Daniel Bakachi believes the Jogos have to throw down the mark again if they are going to go back to the pinnacle of Ugandan football. Uh, it's, it's, it's basically, the first priority is, is the cup. Actually, uh, the, the two cups, we need to get back our salon worship again. It's, it's long since we had it. So we have been working in that direction and uh, administratively we have stre strengthened up. We want to look at that direction, administratively and technically. Meanwhile, new CEO William Kemba says the club is ready to launch an assault on the title this season and strongly believes the mistakes that led to last season's final day debacle have been ironed out. We are ready. We are ready to, be, to kick off and we are waiting for Friday. We will do our best on the field. We will showcase what we do have. And um, yeah, even if there were challenges previously, it would be a sign of progress if um, you have overcome the challenges that you did have previously and now you are better than what you were earlier on. Felix Manindo, NTV Sport.